I'm very pleased to announce that ABC Unified has been awarded by the U.S. Department of Education $5.5 million to convert three schools into thematic magnet schools. They include Aloha Elementary's Health Medical Academy, Nixon Elementary School's Academy of Multimedia Arts, and Tetzloff Middle School's Accelerated Learning Academy. Congresswoman Sanchez's office called to congratulate our district, and this is the fifth consecutive cycle that ABC has been successful in obtaining this grant over the past 15 years. Only 36 school districts in the country were selected to receive this new round of funding totaling $100 million. And considering there are over 1,000 school districts in California alone, this is pretty good stuff. Tonight, the principals from each magnet school is here to discuss their plans now underway in becoming an ABC magnet school. Today, I have two folks from Tetzloff Middle School, Tuesday Stoffers and Krishina Wise, to talk about the programs at Tetzloff. A big Unite Show welcome for both of our guests. Good to see you. Good to see you. Have a seat in our luxurious leather couches. Thank you. Nice, huh? They're Very fabulous. Nice. Yes, yes. Speaking of Tetzloff, I want to give you congratulations because you're not just like Tetzloff Middle School anymore. Now you're at Tetzloff Academy. Absolutely. For it's accelerated learning. Absolutely. Yes. Does that mean your school year actually ends in April now? No, it actually means that we spend the same amount of time in school. Oh. But? But we've looked at the California standards mm -hmm. and increased the rigor. So in this whole race to the top that we've gotten from our federal government, correct? we're going to be moving as a state of California to these what we call common core standards. Okay. Tesla will be the first um, in our move to the common core standards based on what we learned for the state of California. Wow. So, so the acceleration has to do with the um, not necessarily trying to fit more into a school year. It's elevating, like you had said, the rigor of the curriculum that the students will be going through. Absolutely. So we were going to focus on pre-AP courses. So I want to introduce Tuesday Stoffer. She's our new magnet coordinator. Hello. Well, we met minutes ago. Yes, but we did. I'm always good for a handshake. <laughs> <laughs> and she'll tell you a lot more about our pre-AP focus. Yes. Well, um, our magnet is designed to give students the choice or help them make the choice of uh, when they go through high school, mm -hmm. picking classes that are going to be relevant and rig rigorous as they continue on their path to college mm -hmm. and help them give, actually help them make the choice of what they're gonna do with themselves after they go to college and pick a career. Got it. So. Um, maybe, maybe for some people who are unfamiliar, use the term pre-AP. Pre um, what's an AP class in high school? An AP class is an advanced placement class that students can take at the high school level. Mm -hmm. At the end of the year, they take a test, and if they score a certain number on the test, Correct. that class can be applied to college, right. and it can satisfy certain college units. And so it's basically, it gives a high school student the chance to take the same material or coursework and in high school that they would take in college. It's like taking a college class in high school, Absolutely. and then you earn credits for it. Absolutely. Perfect. So if a student in high school takes a certain number of AP courses, they could almost enter college as a sophomore. Yes. I, I, uh, when I was at Cerritos High School, I had a, a friend the same grade as me who went to Harvard. <laughs> who goes there? Anyway, he was like three units shy of starting as a sophomore because mm -hmm. he had so many AP classes. Okay. Now, I went straight in as a junior, but I don't want to brag too, right. too anyway. <laughs> so um, so th that means that you're going to offer uh, courses in the middle school level that prepare for those college type classes in high school then. Yes, because we at Tetzloff, we really believe that having a college going um, environment mm -hmm. begins before high school. Sure. So we need to get a hold of those students and get them on that path before they get into high school. Kind of setting the, the mind, the, getting the mindset and the ambition in Absolutely. that direction. Absolutely. Right? And I'm glad you said something about mindset. What we want to do is increase equity and mm -hmm. access by giving students are opening up those doors. So our mission, and it's so great, UCLA and USC have agreed to partner with Tetzloff. Wow, that's awesome. To be partners in mentoring and also tutorial programs that we will offer here at Tetzloff for our students. Excellent. But what is really exciting is that we get a chance to go to those schools oh. and go to the dorms and go look at what college life looks like. Hopefully inspiring kids are definitely taking away the nomer 
or the misunderstanding that college is difficult to do. Right. So that our kids will go there knowing that, oh, I've already been to USC and I can picture me in this school environment. Right. I think mm -hmm. research has shown that, that when you get students in younger ages into a college setting or, or visiting that, that it, that becomes a reality as opposed to a picture in a magazine or someone's sweatshirt that they see wearing. Absolutely. It becomes like a legitimate. The goal. community has been extremely supportive. Target is there on the corner of Tetzlaw and they've been committed to helping support our vision by supplying and supporting our library program here at school. Awesome. Awesome. Um, we've worked with College Board, the actual group that creates the AP um, mm -hmm. test for our high school students. Um, and in that collaboration, we've been able to work with Artesia High School and Cerritos High School to make sure that our program is in alignment with theirs. Wow, so it seems like there's been a lot of work done to make sure that this program is not just a great idea, but that it's set up to be successful and all the partnering that's been going on and, and the hard work so that when you guys hit the ground running next uh, September, yes. that you it will be you know success right from the beginning, not a big learning process. We are the only pre-AP focused magnet in the, in the county of Los Angeles. Mercy. And we're excited that our students at Tesla will be going to college. So we're prepared and ready to show them how college can be an open window for them too. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for coming on the show and thank for sharing you. those things with us. I'm sure uh, I wish you guys the best of luck next year and continued success this year. Congratulations yeah. again you. on becoming a magnet program. Yes. And uh, with that, we have more new magnet schools. So uh, please stay tuned. <laughs>